for the serious gamer. What's going on, Next Gen Tactics? It's Guns for Hire. Yes, just when you think we're absolutely fully done with Modern Warfare 2, I still am able to pull some stuff out the wazoo. Anyway, this is the Easy Route series for Scrapyard. Keep in mind, this isn't about uh, getting super high kills. Um, I think I do fairly well in this, but it's more or less about knowing how to manipulate a map, how to get from one point to the other, how to get from one side to the other, uh, and finding safe routes. Now keep in mind when you're going through, even though I'm showing you that route there, and a lot of people do know that route, it is dangerous um, for people rushing through. So be prepared for people to rush through. Look at these guys, what are they doing? If you're able to rush through that point, I find that side is the absolute safest. I think it's just my experience from Search and Destroy. If you're heading the other way, most people head this way, which is where A is. Uh, and basically... I think it's natural for everyone to head that way. So when you go through that fire walk on the far side, you tend to be able to break through the other side and surprise them like I did when they're coming in there. Um, and that's another thing. When you're when you're actually on the other side, so now we're back on the, the spawn side again. When you make it to the other end, which I'll show you again when we get there, and I think a better example. So keep in mind, again, easy routes. All I'm doing is going from one side to the other. I'm just showing... Uh, and typically, no matter what the map is, you you basically stay on the perimeter. Don't go on the inside. Now, when you come in here, look up there. See, look up on the on the uh, uh, walkways and stuff because a lot of people oh, like that they tend to hide, and the upper one at the far end as well. So when you reach here, before you don't just go running into this place. I mean, that's where you're gonna get killed, and then you're gonna whine about how there was campers there. Well, yes. You got to know that they camp there, okay? It's just a, it's a normal spot, especially for snipers, but not even just snipers. Those guys weren't snipers. Look at this guy. Dude, could you possibly get out of the doorway? Who, who just stands there? And I blame him for my death there because I would have been on the outside. Anyway. <laughs> you got to blame someone for your death, right? Why not? Why not? Why, why take it on yourself? Well, that guy, there was a bird and it crapped in my eye. So as you see here, all I'm doing basically, and you'll see for the, the rest of the series, is sort of just basically make my way around the map, showing you routes, and this is typically the same. This is actually a very short, uh, well at least, you know, it's not 10 minutes long, anyway, it's like 5-6 minutes long, but it's, it's, just, it's just me basically constantly going around the maps, and then showing you uh, part, of the, part of the easy, oh shoot, that was close, holy spray. Uh, MP5s, especially when you're shooting from the hips, not the greatest. It's not like the MP5 uh, from Call of Duty 4 days. COD 4, oh man, that was an awesome weapon. Whee! There we go, beauty. So remember, whenever you're watching this, and I'm going to be doing easy routes uh, for all three primary games that I'm uh, planning on playing. And remember, like I said, if you haven't seen it already, the viewer's choice, I'll put a quick link uh, at the bottom of the screen and uh, hopefully if I remember to do that <laughs> if not look up viewers choice on our on our YouTube channel and go there it basically it's gonna allow you to vote uh, he's up there at the top uh, he, I think he nails me there you go wall bang idiot but now I know where he is he's probably still looking on that side and we'll give him a little semtex there you go oh you know he wanted that. I mean, if you're going to shoot and kill someone and stay in the same spot, you kind of deserve a Semtex, in my opinion, anyway. In my super amazing, humble opinion. <laughs> anyway, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, the viewer's choice. There's going to be, like, basically three primary games uh, that I plan on covering all the time. So on a daily basis, I'm going to try and give you guys, like, three... Oh, look at that guy. Woo! I got lucky there too, I should have checked that, it was sloppy of me. Again through here, watch for dudes, sometimes they hide inside uh, the little crevice there in the actual fire itself. Oh, there you go. I mean, I saw the one dude uh, and the one up top, but the thing is, when you engage, take the one dude out, either get a kill and then wait, he should be at the top, I would imagine he's up at the top. There you go, nice. Now, I didn't need to stay in there. I just wanted to watch him die. It's the Joker in me. 
I like watching them die. There's nothing finer than when you throw a Semtex and you wait to see them explode. I like to see how they get blown off the catwalks and stuff. It's a little sick of me, but, you know, you know how it goes. Gotta have some fun, right? I mean, this has been out for a long time. You know what? It's still, as much as I do, I know everyone's complaining. Oh, it's this and it's broken. And I'm going to stop complaining about it because the reality is, is, is it's still a good game. It's still a fun game. It's better than most of the games out there. There's a lot of problems with it, yes. But overall, I mean, what are you going to play? Seriously. I heard Crackdown 2, not very good reviews. You know, people are playing it. They're playing it because they're probably just so, oh my God, that was close. Probably just a bit bored. But other than that... I don't know why that guy didn't finish him off. I don't know. Anyway, you'll notice I'm doing basically the same continuous path here. Just staying on the perimeter the entire time. Going around and around and around. And you can get a lot of kills. Stay on the move if you want to run and gun. I know it's kind of weird for you guys to see me doing this. Because you're used to seeing me... Ah... Uh, Oh my god, I can't believe I even got that. Whoa. Normally you're used to seeing me camp and stuff. I do camp. I The reason why I camp is because I find camping to be actually a smarter tactic, uh, especially with these spawn systems that are very hard to sort of predict. Um, that being said, I can run and gun. Um, and you'll see that almost on a daily basis. I will do easy routes like this. I will constantly run and gun. I'm capable of doing it. I just generally don't like it oh seriously how did i miss that acog and what the hell was that i don't even know what it was i'm sure you guys would figure it out anyway that's the end for scrapyard easy roots hope you liked it uh, we're gonna do more again like i said go to viewers choice select what kind of games you want us to cover if you're sick of this vote and i'll switch it up anyway i'm guns for hire from next gen tactics peace